after work and after school. But we at Goodwill. Hopefully we can find some good stuff. We will see. I don't know if I'm cooking just yet, but the stove is definitely heating up. Let me show you what I got so far. University of Kentucky Wildcats. Now, I know there's a vintage version of this one. I think this is like the Y2K version. Um, not as old, but still a nice one. I like this graphic with the little shoulder hit. It's pretty dope. And then we got the over 9,000. Vegeta, what did you say his power level is? It's over 9,000. 9,000? Super clean. <laughs> um, I don't know how old this is either, but it's on that Gildan, so it could be Y2K, could be modern, but I'm gonna still get it because it's dope. No back hit. And then we got the butterflies. Absolutely gorgeous piece of work right here. You know someone put their time and effort into this. And if this doesn't sell, I'm definitely gonna try to get a fit off in this way. Because it's XL, my size, super nice sleeve hit as well. And last but not least, we got that Dell Arnhart Jr. 8 with a little back hit as well, Budweiser. I didn't get to record these because it was loud in there, but we got the vintage wall coveralls. Kind of distressed, but always blessed, man, you know? So nice little cook session. Definitely say it was a W. Sensational life. Sensational. 2002 on the Tennessee River with the cool little woman of faith. Shout out Woman History Month on the back hit. Definitely copping this. I found some unofficial, <laughs> got the unofficial Fire Lord Ozai merch. Fire Lord Ozai will use its power to finish the war once and for all. Comment strong. If you know, you know, on the Y2K Guild. <laughs> little cool little hit. I'm not gonna get it, but that's funny. Found these nice Tommy Bahama suede slip-on shoes. Cool little swordfish detailing on the bottom. These are $5.99 and you can get anywhere between 20 and 30 for these. So I'll get these. I just found these Jordans and I genuinely didn't think they were real when I seen them. I'm like, surely this is like some knockoff Jordan or something, but apparently not. <laughs> they definitely need a lot of TLC. But these are the Air Jordan Aura Black Magic or something like that. But for $5.99, I will get these. These are nice. We're about to head to Clarksville to do some thrifting and shopping. I had to stop. I always talk with my hands. What's this? That's root beer. We have to stop at Panda Express. We don't have one in Kentucky where we live, so. I have to get that good panda, you know what I'm saying? What's up, y'all? We made it to the city thrift out here in Clarksville, Tennessee. We're gonna go up in here. We're gonna see if we can find some finds. And I've been to this thrift store like two other times. The last time I was here, I found a 1998. 1997, crazy, on the Delta Pro way. Billy Ray Cyrus shirt, which I gave away for I think hitting 500 subs, but we're gonna go in here we're gonna see if we can find anything hopefully we can i know the pricing is a little bit different from goodwills all right so here we are we got the shirts right here whole bunch of shirts to go through y'all know what the deal is i'm gonna update y'all if i find anything or see anything hopefully we did we found something so far we got the triple a tag tank just a blank but look you see it 4.99 definitely won't be getting this but they got the shirts priced crazy, so we'll see. We got the Homeland Security since 1492 on the old Gildan. Let's check it out. That crispy old Gildan Ultra Cotton. Definitely be picking this up, and the price isn't too bad. Found this cool National Park t-shirt with all the major parks. Super cool nature t-shirt on the Delta Pro weight. And again, price is not bad. So this is just an example of the crazy pricing. We got a True Religion t-shirt, which is cool. But they want 12 for it, so gotta put this one back. I'm not gonna lie, it's looking pretty sparse in here. I've been through about half the rack. I found one more t-shirt I'm gonna show y'all. This is a Blackwater like vintage military t-shirt. I think it's pretty cool, so I'm gonna get it. And it's only $2.99. But I'm gonna search the rest of this rack, see if I can find anything else. Anything is possible it is crazy. Found another nature t-shirt. It's a Yosemite on the Hanes Beefy for $3.99. I'll pick this up. 
I think this is early 2000s, so this is a nice one. All right, so I just finished that one rack, but I didn't even realize there's a whole nother rack of t-shirts. So I got a whole bunch more to look through, but before I do that, I want to show you something that Faith found for Zara. A little baby Harley, it's too cute. The corporate aesthetic has truly killed traditional art. Look at this. What is this? Okay, cool, front hit, right? Who's buying this stuff, bro? What happened to really dope stuff? Modern bull crap. I finally found some t-shirts. We got this vintage Reeboks Predators on the NHL tag, six bucks, seven bucks. Pretty dope one. I'm gonna get this. And then I found this GTA flip, Roma Vice City Stories. Um, don't know about this. It's on this chip tag, probably some type of bootleg but I will get it only $5 because it looks cool. I found this vintage all pro smoked out blank. I would get it if it was 2X, but it's 5XL. There's nothing I could do with this. I mean, I could actually crop it, but that's doing too much. Um, yeah, I'm gonna leave it behind. But this thing, this is like the perfect fade. I did it guys, I did it, let's go. We found a 2002 The Mountain Dragon AOP style tie-dye, no back hit, but this mug is clean. We're gonna ignore that, but let's focus on the print. We got the beautiful moon in the background. Super sick ass dragon, man. With the, with the light in it right there, too crazy. Vintage North Carolina jersey, Nike, double XL. Only six bucks, definitely gonna get this one. No back hit, but it is clean. You seen this out of thrift. New with tag, how much would you How much would you think this is? And it's a long sleeve. I bet you it wasn't $23.99. What? Insane. I found two really cool pair of pants. I got these vintage Nautica jeans and these vintage Tommy Hill figures, but the price is just not there for me. If I could get these for 10, that would be worth it, but yeah not for not for 20 but these are dope so after searching all these pants i finally found two that's worth it let me show you we got these 6.99 bulwark fireproof basically new without tag um i think i could get away with listing these new without tag because they look unworn then i got these car heart carpenters these are 10.99 i think we out of here we got a nice cart of personals and stuff to resell um yeah not too bad nice little haul i think i'll do i still do a haul of what i got i'm um, still but yeah you got anything to say bye we was about to check out and i went over to the jackets and i found an absolute gem let me show you all this thing we got this super beautiful fat farm with the embroidery nice tag with the back patch as well right here and down below with a little hit on the side as well man this color is crazy it's this orange and blue denim man this thing is nice we got to try this jacket on see how it's fitting this thing is tough angle angle cuts this thing is tough sway sway after a long day of thrifting, I had to come to the spot in Clarksville, Jamaica, Oxtail, you know. Got to show y'all this food right here. It's the best, best Oxtail you've ever seen, bro. Look at this. Do you see that? Oh my God. I'm about to, I'm about to go crazy right now. About to drop Faye off at Marshall's while me and Zara go to Goodwill. So I hope you find something. Bye. <laughs> you, gonna win. you are gonna win. You beat me. Hold on Zara. This is this is kind of hard. A little NASCAR jersey. 
This is dope. I'll get this. Found this yellow Nike side swoosh on the white Nike tag. I think this is like 2009 or 12. And it's XL, might keep for personal. And then I got this Steel Pony Y2K on the anvil. Not sure what it is, I might get it. And then I got this vintage mesh t-shirt, little workout layering piece, yeah. Back at Marshall's with Zara and Faye, and she done found some shoes. Like them? At the Peddler's Mall with it, about to see if we can find some good stuff in here. Hey, look, they really got that shit on. They really out here stepping. Alfred and Dunner made a USA floral shirt for only a dollar. Cool little, like, cable neck kind of design. I think it's vintage. Um, it's pretty cool. I'll get it for a dollar. Y'all, look what I just found. The baby car hearts are too crazy. <laughs> I'm just showing y'all these, not getting them. Look at all these gibbets or charms. We going through them. Faye got a couple. Zara's, I don't know, she's just having fun. <laughs> but then I found some for personal. I'm gonna get Puerto Rican flag, Togepi, Dominican flag, Pokeball, and Spider-Man. Some, we need some, hand some hand essentials. Hand. Yeah, we definitely need some hand sanitizer after this. Touchy. <laughs> Just found Goku. I think this is the last one I'm gonna get. So I just got some brand new rocks today and I just came past these giblets. Is that mine? And so I got Prada, Black Barbie, Alpha, and Black Barbie. Per. Um, Purr Fitter. Cute. LV, because you know it's only right. LV on the LV. And then, so. Okay, nice. Mm -hmm. 